Hi, I'm T. Cooper. I'm a New York City makeup artist, hairstylist, and I'm co-founder of beauty and grooming company Metro Look. Today I'm going to show you how to do a hairstyle like Penny Smith. Penny Smith has so many different hairstyles, but I found one that she wore and I really liked it. It was a half up, half down do, so I hope you like it. So for this style, you're going to need, of course, hairspray. You're going to need either a fine tooth comb or a brush for teasing, a specifically a teasing brush if you don't have a fine tooth comb. You can't just use any brush. You're going to need a paddle brush just to get through all the hair and get all the tangles out. And you're going to need some bobby pins. And it's optional whether or not you want to curl the hair. This, her hair was kind of loose and wavy. My model's hair is already kind of wavy. So if you have that texture, I don't think you need a curling iron. But if your hair is straight, you might want to go in with a curling iron. So let's get started. First, I'm going to section off the hair from behind the ears. A lot of you might want to use your combs. A lot of times I do it with my fingers, which is an awful habit, but I just do it anyway. But it gets the job done. Then once I've sectioned all that off, if you've got long hair, sometimes it'll get a little tangly. I'm just gonna get this hair out of the way for now and put it on top of the head. I'm gonna brush through the rest of it. And now I'm gonna section this hair off to get it out of my way so I can just work with the top. So now I'm going to begin the teasing process. So I'm going to take about a horseshoe section off the top. And then I'm going to begin to tease to create a lot of height on top. I'm going to tease the sides too, but I want to start with the top because I want to poof. And just comb through this as well. Okay, I'm going to comb all of this going forward. So now I'm going to take a big section. I'm going to tease in really big sections. Give it a spray, and then we're gonna tease it. Now we're gonna repeat that process. Tease, tease, tease. Now that we're in the front section, make sure that after you tease, you smooth out the front because you don't want the tease to show through. You don't wanna see knots in the front. See all that great height that's been created? I'm just going to tease a little bit at the sides, just maybe one section, and then again at the other side. Now that you've done that, you can let down the back section and just smooth everything over the top. Then you go in with your bobby pins. I've got a large one, so I only think I need to use one. Pin it underneath and cover it, and then you do the same thing at the other side. Pin it underneath, and then you cover it. And then you are done. You can see what it looks like from the back, and this is what it looks like from the front. I'm T. Cooper, thank you so much for watching.